Hello everybody, this is Luckless Lovelocks bringing you Kingdom. Um, this is a, a kind of like a minimalist strategy, resource management, I guess kind of like tower defense game that uh, I tried out for the first time yesterday on stream. And I just wanted to record a video for YouTube um, talking about it and uh, running you through uh, running you through a game. So I hope you enjoy it, guys. Um, let's get started. So we start as, um, or we play as uh, either a king or a queen that is uh, randomly generated. So the way that she looks is randomly generated. And the map is, is slightly randomly generated. There tends to be um, a, lot of this, there's a lot of similar features in the map. And uh, what the final goal is, I'm not quite sure yet. I, I haven't finished the game, but it all uh, revolves around you building up your kingdom. So the main mechanic or resource that you have to manage is just these coins. So you use these coins to, uh, for instance, build my starting bonfire. So this starts the kingdom off. We drop coins to recruit people for our kingdom. Oh, gave him a second one by accident. Right, so those two guys uh, work for us now, or they're they're part of our kingdom, I guess I should say. Um, and then uh, we also use it to use coins to build tools. I just built a bow and arrow there. And what happens is our recruits will pick up whatever tool they run into first, and that will be their job. So you'll see uh, this recruit, boom, right away. Picks up a bow and arrow and uh, starts, starts hunting. Uh, so this right here is the place where we can uh, assign builders. So you got a hammer that appears, and this worker or this recruit is going to be a worker. So the first thing this game's telling me to do is to build a wall, and the reason why we need to build a wall is because at night, monsters uh, will attack our kingdom. We have to defend our our people from uh, from getting killed. So we'll build a wall over there. We'll build a wall over here. So that's that's the game in a nutshell. It's that it's that simple mechanically, but um, it's quite deep and it's pretty difficult. Um, like I said, I've we played about five games yesterday and still haven't finished it. So you see, she uh, the uh, the hunter. I don't know. I, I always assume the hunter is a sheep, but could could be a man. Um, just dropped a bunch of coins because. Uh, the hunter's been doing some hunting, and you'll see every time they kill something, generate a coin. Keeps missing. There we go. So they'll collect the coins, and when I run into them, they'll, they'll drop them for me, or I can pick them up as they drop. So there's a whole exploration aspect to it as well, so I can walk away from my kingdom, and we'll see there's a little camp here where we can hire, hire some more recruits. They'll walk over to our village and, uh, and join our, our little town. Flourishing town. I'm gonna assign some more, um, some more hunters because they're kind of our main source of income initially. And uh, I'm gonna build my first tower. I can get another tower. See all these rabbits that can be hunted down. Um, so as we as we expand our kingdom, we can also. Um, build up kind of our palace or our castle I guess it would be and that allows us to expand further and get more jobs that allow us to generate more income build larger structures build better defenses and uh, defend our kingdom from the monsters maybe we'll see maybe we'll see a monster attack uh, start up you see, you see one of the archers actually jumped up into this tower that we built and um, they'll they'll fire at at the monsters that come at our defenses. Now, so there's another there's another um, defender archer. Now it's kind of random, it seems, as to when the monsters attack and when they don't. Oh, there's one there. So archer, the archer hit it on the first shot, which is great. Yeah, it's kind of random as to where they attack, when they attack. Um, Still trying to figure it out. Figure out the pattern. If there are any. So basically, we try to, from what I can tell, we're we're trying to survive as long as possible. 
And I don't know if at a certain point we win if we survive for a certain number of days. So we're, we're on to day two now, as you can see at the top middle there. Um, or if it's we have to like kill something. I'm not really sure. So the morning, in the morning we get one of these uh, treasure chests full of gold. Not really sure. Uh, I haven't figured out why we get that number of coins, whether it's the size of our, of our kingdom or the number of inhabitants we have. Not sure yet, but I think what we want to do is um, go ahead and build up our, our palace or, or castle. So we can do some exploring. I, I came from that direction, so let's let's take a look further to the right to see what we can find. I'm really digging this game. I love the music. I love the art style. Um, it's very relaxing for a strategy game. Uh, but it's also pretty deep. But it, it blurs the line pretty well between a casual game and a hardcore game. And it's got excellent replayability. Because of, the, because of the randomized levels. So we've got another camp over here. And then, um, I've run into this guy before. He's like a trader. I'm not quite sure what he does. Um, I'm not gonna hire him yet, because I'm not, I'm not... Seems like a waste of money to me initially, but it might be... Might be like a later game character. So there's a river here where we can build a farm. Um, and we can build farmers as well. And then there's this portal here. So that portal is where monsters seem to come out of. Um, I don't want to mess with that right now because I don't have any defenders out here. And if the if the creatures attack me, what they'll do is they'll pop coins. They'll steal coins from me. And if they steal all my coins and then hit me, my crown will fall off. And they'll try to grab that. If they grab the crown, it's game over. We've got a couple more uh, recruits. So notice my, uh, my horse is like kind of bucking up, it's because it's exhausted and I'm trying to make it run faster. So you just have to wait a bit uh, for it to recover its stamina. Alright, so I think we'll uh, assign another builder and another um, archer. So I want to I want to get ready because I know... First of all, there's all this stuff to hunt. Which is great. And I'm not sure if I want to assign too many hunters. I don't know if they um, if they end up killing all the rabbits and then there's nothing left to hunt. Um, if I assign too many, it's still, there's just a lot of things that I'm still figuring out about this game, just which is cool. All right, so can we expand? Um, I think I'll build up my walls because what's what you're gonna see happen pretty soon is we might get we'll get a red moon. And when a red moon happens, there's a chance for a lot of monsters to attack us. And if that happens and they break through our defenses, we could lose the game. We gotta, we've got to be careful. It's kind of the first priority to build up, build up your defenses. Protect from those attacks. There's one. There's a monster. One, two. Easy. Okay, good. So did they attack the other side too, or was it just... Yeah. Wow, lots of hunting. So if we want to, we can build up another um, another wall here. We can also cut down trees to expand our, our area, our kind of building area. I wouldn't uh, mind getting a farm here, I think. Be nice. But let's, um, let's build up our towers a bit more. And actually, I'm going to hire a couple more archers. I really want, I really want to make it um, far in this game. And I want to get ready for the for that uh, that big attack that I'm sure is coming.
Do you see that guard once I once I took down the tower to be rebuilt turned turned itself into a hunter instead? So we've got to make sure that uh, we're defending both sides as well. Oh wow, big time. See, but now there's like no rabbits to hunt anymore. And I noticed that in the other games I was playing, eventually just hunting just did not do anything for me. We've got a lot of money, so it's a good time to expand our castle. And you'll see a new, um, a new tool. Um, tool, I guess, Craftsman showed up, and that's for uh, farming. And we're going to try to protect that farmer by building another tower here. This might be a good time to get another builder. Got two... I think that's probably... Oh, we've got um, someone without a job here. We've got quite a few archers. This guy... Try to uh, make it to a farmer. Let's see, I just want to see if there's a river on the left-hand side. Maybe we can... Maybe there's a closer river that we can use as a farm. Because that one's pretty far from our city. How long it takes. Um, which one's closer? One, two, three, four, five, six, about six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. It's about the same distance. Oh god. Oh, this isn't good. I've got no boost. So see, he just is taking coins from me. Fuck, that, that was a big mistake. I lost a bunch of coins there because I couldn't run. Is there attack, an attack over here as well? So there's some rabbits that have come back. Which is a good sign. I think there's just, just a, an attack on the right-hand side. I think I maybe want to go for the left-hand side. Farm, um, because that way I, oops, I can keep that, um, that, uh, that tent camp for recruiting people, um, over there, plus the, the portals on the right hand side, so I think that's generally where the monsters come from. All right, I'll go pick up my daily uh, taxes, which is, I, I don't know, I'm assuming that's what it represents. Let's see how many I get. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see if we get more the next day. Okay, I've got enough to build it up. But uh, we, we best be ready, because um, the attack's coming. I know it. The other thing that I know we can build soon are catapults. Just need a bit more money to upgrade. Um, actually, I should get a farmer. Because once we run out of animals to hunt around our, um, our kingdom, we're going to just all of a sudden run into, like, money problems. But the farm will really solve that. The only thing is that um, the tools for uh, farming are really expensive, so if we lose it, if we lose the farmer, that's that's a pretty big blow. Maybe I should, uh, should build this wall. Give these archers a chance to um, defend this side.
Okay, so we've got this side covered, one archer, two. And we've got this side covered with three, I think. And there's our farm constructed. So it looks like he's uh, he's working on that. We've got a scarecrow here. That's pretty cool. I love the little touches of this game. It's just so it's so charming, but it's also like not overly um, cartoony. We can get yeah. See, I think we're gonna we're getting into blood red moon here. Maybe we can get one more archer. Come here. Hurry. Yeah. No, it's just a regular, regular night. Good, good, good. Woo! Couple of monsters on that side. Or if there's anything over here. Oh, he must have gotten attacked. That sucks. So if, if your followers get attacked, or recruits get attacked, um, and they don't have a job, they'll just, you'll lose them as a recruit. Okay, so it's day five, and I, I think, I think maybe every five days, one, two, three, it's always five coins in that chest. Every five days, I think that's when you've got a chance at getting a really, a really bad attack. Alright, let's um, see if we've got any more coins over here. Hunt. And it'd be nice if I could upgrade. Because then I could build catapults, and that'll be, that'll be pretty big for defending our kingdom. Excellent. So now you'll see once that's built that I can build catapults. And you can build one for each side. Just not sure which side to start with. Because, I don't know, you, I, it's not really predictable which side's going to be attacked, so I guess you just kind of take a chance. And we see our, our uh, castle or our palace is coming along quite nicely. Able to find anything? See, our, our economy is really stalled. Uh, hopefully, the farmer can come through. But I think a single farmer isn't that effective. He's working, and we can upgrade the farm eventually, but he's working pretty slowly. See, and these hunters just aren't finding anything anymore. Oh man, that's pretty huge. Great. Let's see if we can get this catapult out. Excellent. And maybe we can get another one out, which would be great. Come on. Come on, Mr. Farmer! I think this is a really well-designed game, and um, just especially like how all the pieces work together in concert. I really, I really appreciate simply designed games that have complexity. So there's our um, catapult being built. Be able to pick anything up? No. Alright, so this is it, guys. I think this is it. I think maybe every fifth day we get uh, Blood Red Moon. But, we've got some defenses, which is good. Some solid defenses. I just wish I could have gotten this other catapult up. Not really, there's not really much else I can do right now. I mean, sometimes these... Oh, there we go. See the sky? The music. 
music. Oh, here we go. There's the attack. It came from the right. I'm gonna throw this coin down, because they'll take that coin. Oh no! I lost the, I lost the crown, I lost the crown. Okay, good. They'll take the coin before um, taking the tool. Oh, this is not good. I'm gonna hang it over here. Nice shot! Yes! Still a bunch of monsters though. I'm gonna grab all my stuff. I think I might be dead. Still one left. No! Oh no! Fuck. That's it! That's it, we lost. No crown, no queen. Only day six. I've made it further. Um, that was a tough one. That was a really tough one. Well, guys, uh, that'll wrap it up for this episode. I'm going to probably post a few more of these um, as, as I learn more about the game. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to finish it. Figure out how to finish it. And you guys will be able to see the end of the game. Um, if you enjoyed the video... Feel free to like it and uh, subscribe to me on youtube.com slash Andrew Erdig. You can also follow me on Twitter at Andrew Erdig. That's E-R-D-E-G. And if you want to watch me stream this game and other games live on twitch.tv, it's slash Luckless Lovelocks. This is Luckless Lovelocks, signing off for now. See you later, guys.